Fuck. It's Rick Denzine from Zero Emission Musicians with Deborah Lee here, and today we're going to be talking about these things, these dental floss things, what to do with them. Oh yeah, yeah. Go out and play. Resist the threat today. Go out and play. We aren't your slaves today. Go out and play. Okay, Rick Denzine here with Deborah Lee, and today, hi Deborah. Zero Emission Musician. Yes, and so what we're doing today is we've got these single use, uh, these are dental floss uh, cases, yeah. and they're single use, and what happens is you use up your floss, and then you're supposed to throw them away or, or recycle them. But the fact is that, you know, a lot of this recycling doesn't actually get recycled at all, never gets re reused, it just gets dumped into the ocean. And so, you know, that's a real bad thing, you know, when, you know, wildlife is eating your freaking dental floss case <laughs> and dying because they, it looks like some kind of food source. So this is a way that you can eliminate this kind of single-use plastic from entering the system and at the same time it'll save you money. So Deborah, you were telling me earlier, so what's the cost of one of these single jobs here? For, if for it's not a generic store brand, uh, it can cost as much as six or seven dollars or, you know, between five and seven dollars. A generic brand might be four dollars or five dollars or something that's, like that. It's yeah. just for one. So mm -hmm. you, you pay four, four bucks or five bucks and then you're going to throw it away, right? When in fact these cases can be reused. So now here's here's what you do. You know, you, you want to go out and get a bulk source of like where you can get these uh, dental floss things. And here's one right here. This one actually has like what? Two, four, six, eight, ten. There's like about twelve of these jams in here, right? Three, six, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah, there's there's I think there's supposed to be twelve in each one. I took one out. So and and something like this, a, a whole double pack of this like costs like ten bucks or twelve bucks or something like that. The links are actually below uh, uh, on this video. And so where to order the dental floss? Yeah, and um, where, where to order this mm -hmm. in bulk. So what you do is you order it in bulk. Then I'm going to show you how to do it for each one of these. You open up this jam, right, like this, boom. And then there's usually some rings that pop out of there. It's great packaging. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's wonderful. You can use it over o and over. Over and over and yeah. over. You, you pop the, the new, you know, dental floss spool in there. And you make sure that it comes up through the little hole, you know, it's a guide hole, and you clamp that thing back down, and then, <laughs> and then, yeah, oh, and then you, and then you just bring it through the little cutter right here. So all this, there you go. So now you're in business with this one for the next bunch, and here's your dental floss right there, regular normal dental floss, right? So here's this other one. Recycle, reuse. Yeah. Yeah. Re repurpose. And save money. Yeah, save money. So the, the, these are examples of these little plastic jams. These little bastards got these in there, right? So we don't know what to do with these yet. Um, we're keeping them for now because we figure we can make some kind of Christmas. <laughs> Hoarding. A Christmas, Christmas <laughs> ornament out of them or some, some crap like that. So we hoard stuff so we don't put it into the whale's belly. <laughs> yeah, and so this one was, you can see here, I had to clip it to make it work. So... This this spool was was actually much cooler to work with, or this this was easier to reuse. This one I had to do a little work because the the new spool did not fit on this; it was too fat. So I just clipped it off with a with a little wire cutter or toenail clippers, whatever, and I clipped this deal off there. And so now it, it can be completely reused. So I'm putting in. I got to figure out which way it goes. So it has to go this way. Putting in the floss new spool this way, and then. Uh, yeah, this one's a little more weirder, but that's okay. And this one closes over the top like this. I got the floss through my little... There Where's your is. magnifying glass? There it is right there. <laughs> it all clamps down right there, right? And it comes through the hole and then to the cutter. So right there, whoops, sorry, right there to the cutter. So boom, we're in business and close it back up. Guess what? Brand new. So that saved us, what, four or five bucks per... 
Yeah, something yeah. like that. So, yeah. so go out and do this. This is a way that you can you know, eliminate some of the plastic waste and reuse and repurpose, right? All right. Checking it out. Checking it out. More Link tips below. later. Yeah. By the way, this might not be the highest thing on the list of priorities. I understand that. But this is just one more thing that we've, we've come to. We, we've got all kinds of things that we have done to uh, eliminate waste and to save money. All right. So it's just one tip out of many we're going to bring you in. Thanks for being our patron on Patreon. Mm -hmm.